Assalamu alaikum guys uh, I hope uh, each and every one of you uh, very well and healthy and second uh, guys I hope you people uh, begin your activity uh, and you can reach your final aims in your life this is my desire for each and every one of you today uh, according to our IELTS uh, series that I am going to make a video and uh, many people uh, may have problems about the reading sections so I am going to begin at the first title by the name of reader what is reader? reader means the one who read the passage, newspaper, magazine, anything when you read we call it what? reader we have two types of reader first active reader second inactive reader let's concentrate let us focus on the active reader what is active reader active reader means scan the sentence to get the main point to get the main idea at the same time what does it mean it means to read the passage read the newspaper and read the magazine and to get the main idea or comprehend the main passage, the main idea at the same time. That is called active reader. But inactive reader means just read the passage, magazine or newspaper. Do not get the main point at the same time. Just read. But he doesn't understand what it says in the passage or in the newspapers or in the magazine. That's all. So let's come to the active reader because we need to become active reader in the reading section, specifically in IELTS test. If it is academic test, if it is gender purpose test. So now, we have two types of active reader. One, extensive reader. Second, intensive reader. What is extensive reader? Extensive reader means do not pay attention on each word. He doesn't consider about each word. Maybe in one passage, maybe in a one newspaper, he may not get the main point, the main, the meaning of each word. But he doesn't care about it. Just scan the sentence to get the main point. He only scan the tenses or the sentences only to understand what it says. What is the main point of this passage? Ah, uh, but. Intensive reader, pay attention on each word. This is one problem that uh, we have it if we become has an intensive reader. Second, uh, we can get the main idea, but take more times. So now, if you want to uh, get good scores in IELTS reading sections, we need to become extensive. So what is the problem of intensive reader? In intensive reader, first, we can get the main point slowly. Second, we consider each word if we don't understand the meaning of it. It means we waste lots of time. So thank you so much, guys. Uh, if you watch this video, you like it. For our more support, you subscribe our channels. Thank you so much.